what is up guys this is suraj welcome to automatic nally this is the 13th episode of our daily technology update here i'm going to talk about some cool technology updates and news so let's get started the first update is samsung j7 pro goes on sale in india it will be available from tuesday with a price of 20990 indian currency from the company's own online store the most highlighted feature of this phone is like the high end devices of samsung it comes with samsung pay service and it is ip54 certified for being plus proof other feature of this phone is it runs on android 7.0 out of the box and supports a 5.5 inch full hd super amoled display exynos 7870 processor 3gb ram 64gb internal and 13 megapixel camera on both front and back the next update is last month a team at the university of zurich managed to build a largest virtual universe but the chinese researcher successfully made a virtual universe almost five times bigger they used world's fastest supercomputer the sunway thiolites 10 million cpu cores to build the largest virtual universe the next update is google is going to make it bit easier to check the battery level on bluetooth devices it should allow an android phone to display the battery level of any connected bluetooth headphones speakers or other accessories but these devices will have to share their battery information so this feature will not work with all product first and it's likely to come with android 8.1 or 9 next update is nearly a month ago youtube said they will remove online terrorist content on its platform and they are taking machine learning into work to make this in faster way youtube claimed that their machine learning system are faster and more effective than ever before over 75% of the videos have removed from youtube for violent extremism over the past month without any notification to pay deals android os native clock app is now available on play store the clock app has earlier been available to the user who run the developer preview for android o in addition to all the features that were found in the previous version of clock app has a dark theme now and the icon has also changed i have given the link in the description so you can check it out for yourself the next update is google is testing an inbuilt ad blocking feature for google chrome which will prevent ads from ruining users browsing experience google is testing this in google's experimental mobile browser chrome canary which has a native ad blocking option which will block pop up ads and autoplay videos The next update is at the annual Defcon in Las Vegas hackers showed hacks on variety internet connected devices a team from Keen Labs managed to hack the Tesla Model X and gain completely access over the vehicle they installed a custom firmware on the Model X and can control everything from the doors to brakes of the car the next update is LG is expected to step up its camera with the upcoming V30 According to the recent report from last year, the LG V30 is rumored to have a camera with f1.6 aperture. Most of these smartphones comes with f2.2 aperture, but unlike them, the iPhone comes with one f1.8 aperture, and the Galaxy S7 and S8 Moto G5 Plus comes with f1.7 aperture. But the V30 will have the largest aperture in the competition, which will result brighter and sharper image even in low light the next update is software giant microsoft has been trying a number of test to speech mechanism for microsoft word but finally microsoft word includes a read aloud feature that allows people to hear the application read out everything written in the word document currently it's available to the office 365 testers and will be available to everyone later this year That's it for today. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Or if you have any kind of suggestion, write us in the comment section. Stay subscribed to see our future videos. Stay happy, stay clean. See you tomorrow with the next episode. Thanks for watching.